Hey guys, this is Toffin, and today we have mower two out of two of the free batch that I got yesterday. And you might be looking, this thing is beautiful. Yeah, they get it for free. Yeah, I only put gas in the carburetor and it fired up. You just heard me right. This is a 2016. Now, I just gave it a scrubbing tin. I always like scrubbing these wheels, make them look brand new. I mean... It is a 2016 unit. I don't have the side flap for it. I just use bungee cords when I do it anyways because it holds it open more than a side flap for tall grass. So I'll just put that in the listing. You could just use a bungee cord. Point of heights work flawlessly. It's no free, it's not freezed or seized. It's free slash seized. This is all tight. Oh, one thing I had to do, I forgot, it took me literally less than two minutes, is undo this bag because this was on the inside. They put the bag on incorrectly. They put the handle inside the bag and it was unexposed. You're supposed to have it like this so you could grab it. I don't know, it's pretty common sense. I don't know how they could mess that one up. What else could, I had this, I scraped under the deck. There was tons of uh, clump, clump grass. Um, I probably would, will I put a new filter? I mean, I have so many of these. I will put one in right now. Yeah. You know, I have so many of these. Who am I kidding to just... I might as well put a new one in. We'll do it together. Bam. Now, the only reason I have those filters on hand is because I actually have a machine with... You might be like, what? You have a fucking Briggs with the plastic carburetor? Yeah, I have this pressure washer right there. Yeah. Barely use it, but I like it, I guess. I mean, whatever. I'm a hypocrite sometimes. Where is this? Oh, I put the filters in this, this row. Whoops. I better have like a big pack of them. Where'd they go? Oh, here it is. One. How does that need filter? These were like a dollar or two per piece if you get a big quantity. And I use it for this machine. Um, right here. Uh, I use that for commercial purposes. This is what I use for my house. I just got it back together. There's a long story on both machines. If you want to know about the story, either comment or I will make a video. If not, then I won't. Oh, here's the Honda, by the way, that I got for free with the clutch. That's the, that's the other one I got with it. I just washed it up. Man, it looks good. Let's put this filter in, y'all. Bam shazam. Bam shazam. Right there. Wow. That's the fuel tank, y'all. I don't see any contamination. Such great shape after I used the car soap on it. Auto choke. Oil is kind of brown, but it's not black. Could use a change. All right, let's give it a go. Oops. I ain't. Give it another go. I didn't even have to clean the carburetor on this one. I just had to give it a jump start. 
And I'll show you the underside of it. Of course, tipping it this way. I know the technically the right way is to tip it on its back, but I don't got time for all that. Let's scrape that all out. And the date of month is precisely January 27, 2016. Of manufacturing, at least the engine block itself. Assembled in Mexico. Oh, USA. My bad. I don't know how where I got Mexico. Yeah, USA, all right. The finest machines ever made in here. It's equivalent to like a Chinese mower. Anyways, that is the free Troy built TB110. This is my second Troy built TB110. Except the second one, the first one was four years ago. And I paid about 20 bucks and I cleaned the carb and sold it for 120. This is worth about 200, give or take. And I will be selling it for that. I'll probably post it for 220. These all work, they're not frozen. Everything's good on this one. That oil is okay, I guess. Oh, pfft. There's a little water in there, I gotta clean out. But thanks for watching, it's tough and I gotta go.